Now we get to Chitara. Now same packaging. I think Chitara has art on the back, along with the text. Um, Chitara. Mm, she's fairly bright. She's a little muted, I think. I think they did mute the colours a little bit on these figures. Um, with the exception of Tigra, I think. He seems to be the same. Okay. Oh, she's tied in. That's going to be fun. Okay, so, and she's taped up. Maybe some people complained about them being not held in their packaging. So she's got six hands, so three sets of hands. Um, I have no idea what this is. It's like a giant flame. Absolutely no idea what that is. Because I haven't seen the show since I was a kid. <laughs> Once on DVD. Um, okay. Looks like she's got one tie, so that's not going to be too much of a hassle. Okay. Now, I did actually notice that um, Panthro and Tiger are actually bigger. They're the same size as Lino. Lino was always bigger than the other figures. And I didn't really think about it, but they all seem to be the same size, which, yes, and she's bigger as well than the original. I'm not happy with that. I've, I wanted them to be different sizes because the characters were different sizes in the cartoon, so the figures were different sizes, but they've made them all the same size. Don't like that. And yeah, they have muted her colours a little bit. She was brighter. So she has two heads. The other guy's just had one head, but I guess, you know, she's needs different hairstyles, of course. And I don't know what her accessories are. So I think you've got to get out. Because I haven't seen the show a lot. I'm not quite sure what some of these, they obviously would be from episodes. And I never shared a slingshot. And, oh my god, what is this? It's tiny. And I've already lost it. <laughs> I'll find it somewhere. Wow, that is probably the smallest accessory I've seen in any of these. And yes, I have already lost it. Fortunately, it's gold. I'll find it. <laughs> okay, so that's the staff. The original staff was just orange, just a piece of orange plastic. So yeah, yeah, I, yeah. The character, the, I mean, the detail is nice. The articulation is nice. Like I said, the plastic's nice. You feel like you can really, um, they really flex and move, and you don't have to worry about them um, breaking or anything when you try and position them and pose them. But um, yeah, the colours are starting to feel a bit muted, and the size is something I wasn't anticipating. But um, the sculpts and the details are really nice, so I'm just going to focus on the positive, because I may end up getting some He-Man Master Universe classics eventually, some of the characters you can't get in the original line or Origins, and then at least they'll have someone to play with. Because right now, I think they're a bit too big to play with their own sisters and brothers. <laughs> 